Romeo 4, welcome back to my channel. And today's video is all about essentials that you're gonna need for weaning your baby. My first top tip would be this high chair. You can spend absolutely hundreds on high chairs, but there's really no need. This is the Antelope high chair from Ikea and it's fantastic. It's only 14 pounds and that's not even the best bit about it. The best thing is it's so easy to clean. Um, there's hardly any nooks and crannies for food to get caught. And if the high chair gets really dirty, you can pop off these legs, stick it in the shower and give it a really good scrub. The next pick would be these bibs from Silly Billies. They're really great. They go over your baby's clothing. This size that I'm putting on Zara now is six to 18 months. She's nearly seven months, she's quite little. And it fits great. The next size up that I still use for Bella, who is two and a half, would be this size. This is the actually extra long mess eater bib and this is age 18 to 36 months. So these are really, really great. Over the top of the fabric bib, I would put one of these bibs. These are Dickie bibs. Um, in the house, we use this kind, which is solid. Um, it goes in the dishwasher. It um, is great for two reasons. First of all, it stops a lot of mess going onto the floor, a lot of it's caught in the bed. And secondly, as they get a bit older and a bit more dexterous, you can pop food in there and they can get it out themselves. This is really great for when you're out and about and you haven't got a high chair with a table. Um, when we do go out, we use these roll-up versions just because they're much smaller and they fit in the back. When it comes to drinks, technically, uh, babies that are still breastfed don't need any additional fluids, um, but we can, you can offer previously boiled water. We do that in these cups. They're from Tommy Tippy, and she can sort of manage them herself. She's getting there anyway. We'll be long, she'll be fine. Um, they're really easy. They, the lid flips down, they fit in my bag, and they're cheap enough to buy lots and lots of them for when we leave them places. My next top tip would be label all of your weaning items with these labels. They're from my name tags. I'll link them all down below. I've talked about them in other videos, and I think they're absolutely great. You can put them on the care labels for fabric, and then after 24 hours, they're machine washable, so great for labeling your bibs. You can put them on beakers and plastic bibs and things, and then after 24 hours, they're dishwashable. So hopefully, by having your child's name and your phone number attached to your items, then if you leave things behind, then they will be returned to you. My next top weaning essential would be these cheeky wipes. Um, these are cloth versions of baby wipes. Um, I find them absolutely fantastic. They're much more efficient for um, cutting through dirt than like giving your baby a full bed bath. Plus, they're much better for sensitive little faces. So you just wipe them up like that and pop them in the wash. Another great buy for when you're out and about would be wet bags. Um, these are absolutely great. Obviously, if you're using cloth nappies, you probably have these anyway, but if you're not using cloth nappies, I definitely recommend using them regardless. They're really great for taking home all the bits that, it's, uh, that your baby's dirtied up during your meal when you're out and about to keep the rest of your bag clean and tidy. When it comes to cutlery, you don't need a great deal for baby leg weaning, but loaded spoons is a good way for baby to eat. To start out with, I would recommend some of these hard plastic spoons. Um, they're better than the floppy kind, um, but when baby is trying to self-feed. So these spoons are great for scooping up mashed potato or yogurt or anything. And ha then you just hand the spoon to baby to um, have fun with. <laughs> so thank you for watching. Please comment down below with any other essential baby buys that you'd recommend for weaning. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon, thank you. Say bye, Tara.